guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting rain to episode one of Fruits Basket, the final season, BTW before we start. So the file that I got downloaded um, was 31 minutes. I cut the second half of it because it was just the cast really talking about questions and everything. So um, I have the first 20 minutes, so just in case, because I know somebody's going to be confused, and I was confused about, like, why the heck this episode was 31 minutes long, and then I looked, and I was like, oh, okay, that makes sense. So, yeah, other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode one in three, two, one, go. Now, see, originally, I thought this thing was supposed to come out last Wednesday, and I was all ready for it, nothing, and then I kind of... Put it in the back of my mind. I was like, I'm gonna wait. miss this music so much. Jesus, your English voice is nice. Oh my god, like, hello. <gasps> I know, right? Girl. Oh. Your mom. She pretty. Look bitchy, but she pretty. Why though? Cause I I literally cannot remember anything right now. Of course. Hey, hey, stop! You're gonna kill your mom!
No, see, mm, no, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait a little bit longer because I got a real good question and I wonder if they're going to talk about that. Mm. You all did. And you all ran towards her. Cute, my baby. Mm -hmm. Scared and in pain. I mean, she was ready to kill her damn mom. Like, whoo, shit. Mm. Of course. I don't know what to say. Don't make me cry. I can't do this again. Oh, you're so fucking pretty. I love you so much.
McDonald's. Oh, Jesus Christ. Love him so fucking much. Mm-hmm. 
just blow up. Oh shit. Nah, bitch, fuck you. Yeah, it is. Yes, ma'am. Was it tropical polo that we were getting the stuff? Yes. Yes, a tropic bowl. It's a tropic bowl. All right. Okay. Bye bye. Sorry, emergency call. Oh.
Jesus Christ. Okay. First initial thoughts on this final season. Jesus Christ. I wasn't ready for all this. I mean, yes. As someone who has read this damn book, I'm like, mm, yeah. <laughs> you know, the emotional of it. Jesus Christ. But to see, honestly, I gotta say the dub did a damn good job. Like, oh my God. I haven't watched the whole entire freaking season one and season two dubbed and I think what I'm gonna do is like when the whole entire show is done I think I'm gonna rewatch this all in dub because I my first exposure to this series when it came out so many years ago was dubbed and then I watched the sub and such but like honestly they did a damn good job I you know the chilliness from uh from uh Akito's mom oh god whoever voices her 10 out of 10. I'm sorry. That was too fucking good. I hate her so much, but she scares the shit out of me just as much as Akito, because you know, mm, yeah, yeah. The biggest thing is that I'm kind of wondering, especially if this is for people who have, um, from what I remember, because I don't remember much from the manga, but I'm going to try to talk about the situation of certain things from the last few, or not from the last few, from the very last episode of the original Fruits Basket and the situation of the things that Akito has to deal with and um the curse and everything and all that yeah are they eventually going to talk a little bit more about that and what her situation is and do it because I don't really remember because now it makes me want to go back and rewatch season one and season two and see if they did current oh fucking current like to just show my husband those curry no and fucking Anthony. Thank you. Like oh my god, I miss these what these fucking husbando so damn much. Like it feels like it's been forever since season two aired, and it's like oh my god, everything is finally coming up to light. Everything that I've been like hiding that like keeping that secret about Akito and her being a female and such but me still every single week saying he she you other every single week and we got to that last episode I was like bam it's there and you know everybody was all freaking out I just I remember when like the freaking mashup came in and I was there and people were like what the heck and I was just like yeah surprise and shit I just I I Oh my god, this was just so good. I was not expecting to cry as much as I did into this first episode. And I think, honestly, when the sub version comes out, whenever the first episode officially airs, I am going to rewatch this because, I mean, this was good. Like, really, really good. It's getting down to the wire. I, I hate the fact that I really want, I wanted, wanted so freaking bad to see Arisa and Korean you know, to just talk one last time but of course we can't get it but it, 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 you know we can't talk about it yet <laughs> we just can't talk about that shit yet but you know when we get there we get there and I think I might have to like kind of reread but I think at the same time I, I don't think I am I think I'm just going to just you know still remember things bit by bit and then you know if I have to just talk to people about it but yeah this was a really good start to the final season thank you for making me cry for like majority of the whole freaking episode because you know that's how it starts and this train of emotional is just <laughs> it's going up and it's going up and then we're just gonna crash and burn by the end of the series and we're all gonna be like hot messes by the end of this show but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode one of fruits basket the final season if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially sometime in april for when episode two officially airs but then <clears throat> until then i will see you guys all officially next time bye guys